you know, I always encourage people to download my videos, share my videos. I don't mind if you make money, like advertising, etc. That's not not the problem for me. Sir, and you are not ready to talk. Mute YouTube, you please. Mute YouTube. Hello, friend. How are you? I hear you. Go ahead. What do you want to say to us? Yeah, please. Um, Let us see. Mute YouTube, if please. We can find the video. Okay, okay. I'll mute YouTube. In English. Okay. All right. Can you hear me? Yeah, I do. Go ahead. Show me one Quran verse that uh, shows Muhammad own slave. One Quran verse, Muhammad own slave? Yes. Okay, if I show you what you would do. Well, then you prove yourself to be correct. All right. So you think the Quran never say Muhammad have a slave? Is that what you think? Say that again. So you think that Muhammad in the Quran never owned slave according to the Quran? He never, the Quran never said that. So you are sure? Yeah. You are sure, right? Okay. Read for me this verse. Chapter 33, verse number 50. Read, read, I want to hear you, you know. I like to hear Quran, I enjoy Quran. Well, what's happening? Can you put the Arabic? You read it in Arabic, here we go. I mean, I, people, they are listening to me in English. You read it in Arabic, no problem. You speak Arabic, supposedly? Yeah, I can speak Arabic. Okay, go ahead. Go back to the Arabic version. It's in Arabic already, and you do not need to show me. I mean, open your Quran. Don't you have a Quran at home? Do you need to call a friend or somebody? Yeah, can you translate it, please? What my malakat you mean it? Hey, don't tell me, can't you translate? You say to me, show me one verse in the Quran saying Muhammad have his slaves. And here we go. This is your Muslim, this is your Muslim translation saying, whom your right hand possess. One second, let me find hmm. this one. Which verse this one? What's wrong with you? How many times I had to repeat? So you are reading and you are opening the Quran and you do not know what verse yet I told you. Chapter 33, verse number 50. Relax, don't be nervous. Chapter, it's okay, Allah will send Jibreel to support you. Are you there, my friend? 
So look what happened. You were so excited. You want to call me. You are desperate to prove to me because you never heard that the Quran saying Muhammad has the slaves. This is happening because you are not talking to someone like me. Don't challenge Christian Prince. So now you're a prophet. He owns slaves. And not only he owned them, he kidnapped them from their families. So what do you want to say to us? Don't find it here. Is it correct? You have some friends there helping him. Three, four people still they can't answer. How's that? Jibri can't answer. Read the Arabic again. Mm. Shall I go and take a shower and come back? I mean, what happened? The verse is small. Come on, tell us something. What do you want to say? So we see the Arabic again. I showed you the Arabic and then you asked me to go to the English and now you say me the Arabic. What's wrong with you? I mean, I give you the verse. You have the book. Tell us what do you think? I'll call you back in two minutes. Oh, you want to call me back? Where, where are you going? I have four wives waiting for me. I mean, 13. Two minutes, two minutes. What two minutes? Where are you going? Where you want to go? Are you with me? Are you are asking me, am I yes. with you? I'm sleeping already. I'm waiting for you. Yeah, go ahead. All right. You understand, uh, you understand Arabic, yeah? So if I say this in uh, in Arabic, so... Uh, you no, I understand. don't understand Arabic. Yes. Speak in English. You call me in English, I... speak in English. We are an English program. I want I... people to hear you. I want people to hear your answer. You yeah, call me. I... You call I, me, I you, you ask me the for, question in English, so you oh, need I, to answer oh, first in right. English, please. Talking, we, we are talking right now about Quran, and Quran is revealed in Arabic language, and, and to translate... It doesn't matter. Arabic okay, the Quran is in Arabic. The Quran is in Arabic, and the translation yes, made by Arabic, Muslim in so, the front of so us. Stop speak, playing games. So if you speak Arabic, if, if you speak Arabic, I, I'm, going, I'm going to tell you exactly what does that mean. Right, maybe Arabic I don't and, speak Arabic. What's wrong with you? you? Maybe I don't... But my Arabic is very weak. The only the Arabic word I know is Bismillah al Rahman al Rahim. So uh, this is not, uh, you know, not, not no, 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 no. I'm, I'm going, I'm, I'm, I'm going to explain exactly what, uh, what is written over there in in Arabic language. Hmm. What is written there in Arabic language? Go ahead. All right. Okay. The meaning of this ayah. Hmm. Yeah. يقول تعالى يقول الله تعالى مخاطبا النبي يا بأنه قد أحل له من النساء أزواجه التي أعطاهن مهورهن you know what the meaning of مهورهن وهي الأجور ها هنا كما قال مجاهدا وغير واحد وقد كان مه وقد كان مهره لنسائه اثنتي عشر وقية وإنش what does have to do with my topic what does have to do with my topic read for us what it says his right hand possessed وما ملكت يمينه وما ملكت يمينه which is your right hand possesses yeah wonderful what does that mean what does that mean that means that means أي ما أباح لك مما أخذت من المغانم المغانم which is what you have Get it from if, if from the war you won. Okay, so the so are they this, are those this, our slaves? This, are those our slaves? No, 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 no. Maganim, Maganim. What does what does Maganim mean? Maganim. If are, you, if you know Arabic. Okay, are they is, are the TV? Are so so so, so you are are you saying that your prophet is allowed to have sex with the TV? Is that a Maganim? Is that a woman or it is a TV? Maganim, it's a uh, Maganim. Anything can be Maganim. What it is? No, what it is? No, 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 no. Listen, listen. Okay. Let me, let okay. me, let, let, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Have you ever heard? Have you? Ever, okay, let me ask you. What interpretation you are you are reading from? Excuse me. What interpretation book you are reading from? 
I'm telling you the sharh of uh, of the ayah. Okay, from which interpretation? <laughs> what is the name? What? The sharh, the sharh. What is the name of the interpretation? What is the scholar? What is name? The, the scholar of this one. Hmm. What happened? Kathir. Ibn Kathir, that's wonderful. Okay, guys, did he say Ibn no, Kathir? No, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hold on, hold on. Okay, you chose Ibn no, Kathir. Okay. That's it. We will go to Ibn Kathir. We will not waste time. Here we go. I will go to Ibn it's Kathir. Not, it's not Ibn Kathir. My it's friend, no uh, problem. Is Ibn Kathir is good for you or not? Is no, it... sorry, it's, it's the Sha'rawi. It's the Sha'rawi. Okay, is Ibn Kathir good for you or not? No, Sha'rawi. Go to Sha'rawi. I'm asking you, is Ibn Kathir is good for you or not? It, de it depends what Ibn Kathir you have. If if it's the Ibn Kathir Shia version of, or it is the Ibn Kathir Shia version. I never heard of Ibn Kathir Shia version. Ibn Kathir is a Muslim Sunni. Of course. Yeah. No, 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 no. Hang on a second. On the internet, there is. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Mr. Shia, Mr. Shia version, Mr. Shia version. Was Bilal a slave of the Prophet of Allah or not? No. No? <laughs> no. Okay. Was, Ma that? was Mary the cooked a slave? Was Mary the cooked? Was Mary the well, listen? You was Mary have, was Mary the cooked a slave of have, the Prophet of Allah? Have, yes or no? You have you have no true evidence of what you are saying. Well, I just showed you. It says, okay, everybody will see. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, in front of us. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on Abdul, Abdul, listen, listen. Okay, this is your Muslim translation. It says they are saying those are, are those. Okay, listen, listen. The translation in front of you, it says those who they are the prisoners of war. It's in the front of you. Even your Muslim got you busted with your lies. It says the prisoners of war. Is the TV a prisoner yeah, of war? Yeah, of course, a prisoners of war. And the Prophet Muhammad, with the presence of war, he he offered them to te anyone. Any one of them can uh, can read and uh, can uh, can write and read to teach Muslim people, and then he will get his. But you, but the that verse here is speaking about war. having sex with them. This verse here is speaking about having sex. It's lawful for you. Okay, what about your wives? About about Listen, Bilal. you say to me, you okay. challenge me, so you agree now. Bilal. So you I'm agree. Telling, so you I'm agree. Or you ag Bilal. okay? Hold on. So one by one, we will go to Bilal. Bilal. So you agreed Bilal. that your prophet he owned Bilal. slave Bilal. girls, yes or no? Bilal was, was Let me Bilal. ask you: Did your prophet yes. he own slave girls, yes or no? Okay. Either you say yes, it says yes. that they are captive okay. of war, you or you say no. You mentioned Bilal. I, I will show you Bilal. I'm asking you before we change. Before we go, before we go to Bilal, did your prophet own slaves from war and they are women and he raped them? Yes or no? Show us your proof for Bilal. It's in the front of you. What Bilal? Bilal, he did not rape him yet. He raped women. Now we're talking about women. I showed the, because you said to me, show me Quran. So now this is the Quran. Then I will go to the Hadith of Bilal. Hmm? What happened? Bilal. Hmm. Yeah, Bilal. So? Did your prophet own girls and he sleep with them? Yes or no? Here we go. You said to me you are reading Tafsir al Sharawi, right? Okay, here we go. This is a Sharawi, and the Sharawi getting you busted. Why you are you lying? Are you there? You said yes. to me you are reading a Sharawi. It says, In Milk al Yamin, Yatimin al Asra fi Harbin Mashru'a. So they are prisoners, and those are females. So why you are saying here we go? It says it says too. وملك اليمين قد يكون من النساء فتد فتدخل في نسائهم أو يكون من الصبيان. So they can be women or even boys. 
So you're a prophet is lawful for him to have sex with women and boys. This is a Sharawi. This is the tafsir you are reading from. It's in the front of my eyes. What you are talking about? You are reading from a Sharawi, right? This is a Sha this is a Sharawi. Read for me. Does it say? Does it? Hold up. Listen, 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 listen. Listen. Does it say? Read with me. Read with me. When when you pull your mind, you say you are reading from a Sharawi. Everybody heard you. You know something? You are playing with the word. You are mixing. I am not. This is a Sharawi. This is a Sharawi. This is a Sharawi. That means the little boys, the boys, they 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 still babies. Malikatul Yamin. Who are the Malikatul Yamin? It is lawful for you. Okay. Does the Quran says? Okay. Listen. 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 And it says, well, what does mean? Our lam yadhar ala awrat nisa. That is babies, the babies. Haha, you are mixing with okay, the word. Okay, listen, 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 listen. Listen, you said you are reading uh, a Sharawi, and a Sharawi is saying Malikatul Yamin is the capture of war of women and children, and it's lawful for you to have sex with them. This what it says in the front of you. So what we will do now? And I can open right now in English. Where is the part for the women? It says here in front of you. You, you claim you speak Arabic, right? Here we go. It says, "Idnun fi dukhuli ala al-mar'a," and then, "Malakat aymanahum al-ahdab." Fifty-five. قلنا إن ملك اليمين يأتي من الأسرة في حرب مشروعة. And then he continues saying that this is قد يكون من النساء فتدخل في نسائهن. And this is a yeah, Sharawi. Yes, yes. What, what's wrong with that? If it's woman, okay, she joined the the woman. This okay. is what you are saying so in Arabic. She, he, so but you're a prophet. He own. Okay, so you're a prophet. So you're a prophet. So you're a prophet. He own a slave. Okay. You know something. Listen, listen, listen. So you're a prophet. Did he own those women? You're a prophet. Did you? Okay. Listen, listen, listen. Listen, listen. Okay. Listen, 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 listen. listen. Listen, let, let me let me get you busted. Let me get you busted one by one. Okay, read for me. Who's here to join? It's different than what you are saying. No problem. Abdul, listen, listen, Abdul. Join. Listen, listen. The woman. If it's woman to join the woman. Okay. If it's if his kids to to join the kids, but it's not to, to have sex with the woman. Or okay. Sex with okay. The hold kids. hold on hold on hold on hold on. Read this hadith for me. I don't want to hold on. You are mixing the word with you. No, we are not. We are not mixing. And here we are getting you busted. Did your did your prophet did your prophet rape Sophia? Did your prophet could not? Did your prophet have a gift? Hold on. I will get you busted in the front of everyone. Your your prophet your prophet. I will name for you, and we will show you reference one by one. This is the first verse we showed you. It says that your prophet is lawful for him to have sex with any slave woman he own. In the top of that, any Muslim woman she can give herself to the Prophet. Secondly, listen, is it true that before we go there, is it true that if the Prophet his eyes fall into a woman, the Prophet, the, the husband must divorce her so the Prophet he can have her? What are you showing on the screen? I'm asking you, is it true? If you're a prophet, his eyes fall into a woman. The husband must divorce the wife so he can have her. What's your proof? Here we go. And I'm glad that you speak Arabic. We can't see anything. All right, a second. Don't hang up. What do you hang up? Here we go. It's there. Don't go. Potato. Why do you hang up? What? Here we go. This is the official government of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia website. And this is Tafsir al Qurtubi. And you speak Arabic. Now let us see what it says there. And this is explaining to the same verse we are talking about here, about Malikatul Yamin. You see it in the front of us. How do we know? How, how do we know what you are showing us? It's true. 
It what is. Here we go. Oh, here we go. This is the address. I, I will show. I will show the address. Don't stop lying. You can. You can go right now, and everybody will see if this is really the official government website of Saudi Arabia. Here we go. Look at the address. Quran su dot education dot sa. So yes, it's true, and this is Tafsir al Qurtubi. And now we go and we see what Tafsir al Qurtubi is saying. And you can open from your side Tafsir al Qurtubi. I read with me. If I am lying, then I'm saying I'm lying. And now you are you speak Arabic, so you have no excuse. Here we go. Let us see. It says what and what Muhammad did. It's a bit late. <laughs> the YouTube is late. No problem. You will see it. <clears throat> what he's saying, we can see it on the screen. Okay. I think they posted the link here. This one. Read with me carefully. The Prophet, he had many privileges, and those are the privilege of the Prophet. We will start from here. This is Tafsir al Qurtubi. Starting from privilege number one. Do you see the screen with me? <clears throat> Do you see the screen? Yes, but it's late. All right, no problem. Do you see it now? Yes. All right. You speak Arabic, right? Don't tell me you don't speak Arabic. Can you read for us what is there? Do you want me to give you the link so you can read from your side? Read for me the line number 10, the very privileged number 10. إِذَا وَقَعَ بَصَرَهُ عَلَىٰ إِمْرَأَ وَجَبَ عَلَىٰ زَوْجَهَا طَلَاقُهَا If the Prophet, his eyes fall into a woman, which means he like her, the husband, he must divorce her. So the Prophet... Where is that? Where, so where the, is that? Where is that? This go is back, the Seer Al-Qurtubi. It's in the front of your eyes. Show me that, show me that, show me that. I'm showing Stop. you that. It's in the front of you. No, no, where is it? Where is that? I'm showing you. It's in the front of you. YouTube is asleep. All right, so so this one, how, how would I know that what you are telling us right now, it is a true from the tafsir? Be very easy. You can open the tafsir from your side and you read it. I mean, how? what a big deal. You can open the book of tafsir and you can read it. Very easy in front of everybody. Okay. This is in the book of Al Qurtubi, page number 187. Tafsir Al Ahzab, verse number 50. One second. What's happening? You speak Arabic, you do not need 10 hours to, uh, to come with the answer. What kind of a prophet, if a woman walk in front of him and she is married, 
and she is a Muslim, her husband must divorce her so the Prophet he can jump on her. And this is Arabic, and this is Al Qurtubi, and I gave you the page number, and I gave you the Islamic website, and this is the official government website of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. I'm opening this website and I can't find what you are saying right now. You are now. lying, I'm my friend. It's in the front of me. Here we go. I will give you I will give you the link. Stop lying. Here we go. This is the link. Open it from your side. I give it to you in Skype. Okay. You see here. See, he he he's playing with the word. It is the same. Yeah, you have to be in a as wajik and let you after the hunna muhur hunna wa bahna laka ma malakat yaminuku min al ima. Don't jump what I'm saying to you. Read it. How come you are not reading what I'm giving you? Does it say there that if the prophet his eyes fall into a woman, her husband must divorce her so the prophet he can f her? Yes or no? I'll send it to you. Get my charger back again. Hey, here you go. Just check in the verses, okay? No problem. I wonder why it's taking you so long. I'm giving you the, the, the link. This is the Islamic government website of the uh, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, official. And you are still checking. I don't know what chicken. I mean, what? it's in front of you. What's happening now? Why is taking two of you? Like, are you both of you shake? You grow beard? So two shakes, they cannot answer a line in their book. So look what we proved. That yes, your prophet, he owned hundreds of his slaves and he raped them. In the top of that, if a woman, she walk in front of him and she is married, still he have the right to take her and strip her from her husband and he jump on her. And you are in disability, and you speak Arabic, you have no excuse. Can you show us Bilal in the meantime? No problem. We will go to Bilal. Don't worry. <laughs> this is bigger than Bilal. What kind of a prophet? And not only that, we will show you Bilal and we will show you that Bilal begging for his freedom. Just wait. It's coming. But one by one.
anything. I can't find anything on Facebook. Yes. It's interesting. Not any sources like uh, to find this one, but uh, what he's saying. I didn't see when you um, cut the competition. Uh, iCloud. So what's happening now? Why is it taking so long? Trying to confirm this uh, KSU website. Oh, what confirm? I gave you the website, and this is the official government of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. We can click down. It says contact us and it will take you to the official government of Saudi Arabia. And you do not need this website, by the way. You can just search the sentence in Google and you will find all your Islamic books saying that. You do not need even the website I gave you. Give us two minutes, we'll call you back, yeah? Where you want to two minutes? Come on, just finish it. Don't you want to go to Bilal? We, we have many. We have Bilal, we have many women. Muhammad, he raped them. We have the evidence, we have the reference, we have the page number, we have the hadith number, and you will be having fun for the rest of the night. This is the start. We are just saying hello. I need to get my charger. Ah, the charger. It's both of you. Why both of you will hang up? You don't need a charger. You have no answer. It's a shame for the prophet. Let's go to Bilal first. What Bilal now? Uh, this is more important. And we will go to Bilal. Don't worry. Do you think you can answer for Bilal? If you cannot answer for this one, you can answer for Bilal. Everybody knows that Bilal is a slave of a prophet. What's wrong with you? Every single Muslim in the world know that Bilal is a slave of the prophet. Are you kidding me or what? <laughs> I mean, even Muslims, they are texting me in Skype saying, tell this guy, we are Muslims, but he's wrong. The prophet, he owned many slaves. Even Muslims are upset from you. Bilal was the first black sheikh. Uh, my friend, your Bilal did not get his freedom even from your prophet. Your Bilal, he got, we, when Muhammad he died, he came to Abu Bakr saying, Abu Bakr, if you bought me, because, because Bilal was a gift from, from Abu Bakr to Aisha. <laughs> he said to him, if you bought me for the sake of yourself, will keep me for your sake of yourself. But if you bought me for the sake of Allah, free me. Is that true? What's your proof? Yeah, okay, no problem. You are talking to Christian Prince. Where's your proof? Here we go. This is the proof. Read it. The YouTube is slow. It's not YouTube, it's slow, my friends. It's you. You are ashamed of your prophet. You do not know what to say.
where did you get this from don't change the topic you, you see i'm talking to two one of you now i want you to think about Bilal's story and the other yeah, one he need to answer me the other one he need to answer me two of you so you cannot keep busy in one thing one of okay, you need Bilal. to answer me i need an answer about your prophet i give you two okay. things already i call you three oh, things actually okay, and you cannot answer okay, anything okay, you so, are saying about Bilal, okay you said you said Bilal. no 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 he is the one talking to Bilal. you you i gave you time to read about your prophet having sex with women who they are not his wives he forced the husband to divorce them why you are changing the topic what are you doing are you trying right. to escape the disaster i gave no, you no no okay no, then answer no, no, but, then answer no, but, the privilege of the prophet they are 17 19 the privilege number number 10 if the prophet his eyes fall into a woman her husband must divorce her and he can f her so you took all this time to jump to Bilal, right? Because Bilal will rescue you. No, you cannot do that with me. And here we go. I showed you Bilal about Bilal. Bilal begging for his freedom. Saying, if you bought me for the sake of yourself, keep me for the sake of yourself. If you bought me for the sake of Allah, leave me for the sake of Allah. So, let us be honest. You are ashamed, aren't you? One second. Who was of you is the sheikh? Both of you are sheikh or only one of you? I'm talking to shaky sheikh. Do you know how many times you told me one second? Did you decide to leave Islam? Isn't it obvious that Muhammad is a bad man? He look at a woman, her husband must divorce her? This is a gang leader. This is not a prophet. <clears throat> My friend is checking the KSU website too. <laughs> I feel sorry for you. <laughs> You're a prophet. He received he received gifts as a human being. He used to receive gifts in Amazon, free shipping and handling. Maria the Copt, her cousins, her sisters, her niece, her nephews. He he received them as gifts and he kept them as a slave and he raped them. What about Sophia, the one who kidnapped her? What about Bani Mustaliq, who he attacked them and he take all the women and he raped the women and he exchanged her with Dahya al-Kalbi? <laughs> <laughs> 